Right, so welcome back to the vlog, everybody. I've got um, my sidekick here again, uh, and we're at Hernhill Velodrome. Uh, and I've not ridden Hernhill Velodrome before, so this week's vlog is going to be my experience on the track. Now, I've ridden indoors before on a velodrome, but I've not ridden a bike without any brakes for quite some time. So I'm a little bit scared right now. Um, I, I don't know whether to look forward to it or be scared, but I'm with the track pro. Uh, she's raced track all her life, so she'll be telling me, uh, give, well, whipping me into shape and uh, teaching me some skills. Uh, I mean, I'm in, it's a beautiful spring day. Uh, I'm in the beautiful Le Col HC summer jersey of 2019. I think it's about time. I've heard the whistle go for all of us to get on the track. So we need to get our bikes. We need to get on the track and I'll see you, I'm gonna put my number on. Doing the old wheels up, ready to go. First track session, a little bit nervous about this. Right, first track session in uh, quite some time. Are what you confident that he's that allowed one? on the track? Because you know, it's been a while. <laughs> Right, ready to go. Right, so we've just done the warm up and I've been allowed to grab the camera and uh, take you on the track. So I'm gonna roll on now. Here we go. Right, Rebecca, for somebody who's only ever ridden a road bike, uh, when you first ride a bike with no brakes, what are the best tips you can give somebody? Well, as with anything in cycling, you've got to stay relaxed. You've got to practice your start and stop. So it's very simple, nothing to worry about, but you just gotta make sure that you know sort of how to lose pace to grab onto the outer fence or the inside fence, whichever the coach is. It's like kicking back a bit then. Yeah, or like... So I always say it's not necessarily a kick back, it's just you'll get such a feel very quickly for how you ease off on the fixed gear. Um, and it's just about understanding your speed and everyone picks it up within a couple of laps. It's, it's quite simple, it's just getting a feel for it and remembering to keep pedaling at first. Session one done. How are you feeling? Better than expected, but I think it's because of this absolute beauty. I don't know if you can look down and see this. I mean, check this look, windy miller. Look at that paint job. I think this is worth at least 40 watts. I mean, I'm feeling pretty gassed after that. Um, drill one done. Drill two about to start. We've all got to get up on the fence. Uh, I haven't got much time, so I'll see you back on the track. Right, here we go. Drill three, back on the right side of the track now. Well, that's it, drill two done. Uh, had to ride the other way around the track, which was a bit of a challenge. Uh, never done that before. Um, I said, never ridden Hearn Hill. I've always done my track at Lee Valley. Um, but it's a wicked track. Uh, just done a drill, um, just riding in the string, you know, one line, uh, just doing changeovers, right to the top of the track, back to the line. Uh, this is a basic skill session. Uh, so not too much uh, racing going on, except at the end. Then uh, everybody's egos comes into it and everybody's a bit of a race. That's always good fun. Oh my goodness. You should have been out to lap me and he was nowhere near, not even half a lap up. Well, kind of just rolled off the front though. Um, <laughs> wicked session. So for any of you who've never ridden down Hearn Hill, it's well worth a little ride down. Uh, do a session. Mega good fun. Go and do your accreditation. And then check this out. Like banging. Banging tunes.
hope you enjoyed this short but very sweet uh, and a little bit exhilarating vlog around Herne Hill Velodrome. Uh, if you did enjoy it, make sure to give it a like. And if I inspired you, if we inspired you to get on the track, then let me know in the comment section below. And if you do ride Herne Hill, uh, let me know how it goes. Uh, and I look forward to seeing you guys soon. And for all of you who haven't subscribed yet, make sure you hit subscribe, turn notifications on, and I'm sure I'll see you all very, very soon.